Okay, so let's continue on then. Let's actually just make a database, right? So we've already got this. Now, if you're importing, you can right click on the databases folder and import there. You need a backpack file and you just press next and you locate the file on your computer. Pretty straightforward or from Windows Azure if, if that's how you're doing it. Let me close that because that's not what I'm going to do. I'm just going to simply go new database. Now I've got to kind of think about the names because I've done a few takes in this video with some technical issues. <laughs> so I've been doing a few of these. So let me just not change anything, right? Let's just keep it simple because we're creating a database. I want it to call verbs. Okay, I had done that one. Let's say verb. Oh, accidentally pressed it, but whatever, it's gone through. And it's called verb fine so we've created the database ah, well as I'm on the fly then let's see if I can rename it to verbs yes it's okay with that there you go that's how you create a database in SQL Server Management Studio check out this video for more now to see how to create the tables in there and check out this for more on SQL Server Management Studio in general I'll see you there hope you find this useful